The member for Shuswap. Well, thank you very much, uh, Honourable Speaker. British Columbia is home to some of the most stunning lakes in the world. They not only provide us with a water source, they're also home to recreation and countless memories for families and friends. However, our freshwater lakes and river systems are facing an unprecedented threat from invasive quagga and zebra mussels. This issue transcends mere environmental concern. It strikes at the heart of our regional identity and economy. The introduction of invasive mussels into our waters would be catastrophic. These organisms relentlessly damage ecosystems, disrupt natural food chains, and cause severe economic repercussions. Between May and December of 2023, BC's Invasive Mussel Defence Program intercepted 155 watercraft on their way into BC that were identified as having high risk of mussels. 79 vessels were decontaminated, 36 were quarantined, and 14 vessels were confirmed to have invasive mussels. In Idaho, a mere 11-hour drive from our borders, invasive mussels were confirmed in 2023. This proximity is a stark reminder of the imminent danger we face. Unfortunately, just as this threat is reaching its apex, surveillance funding has been dropped from the federal government and other partners. This is not just an environmental issue, it is about preserving the essence of our region for future generations. The District of Sycamus, the Cloner Chamber of Commerce, BC Wildlife, Wildlife Federation and others have voiced their heavy concerns over this situation. I implore everyone from local residents to governmental bodies to join in this critical effort. We must take immediate action. Together we can protect the natural beauty and resources that define us.